Hey, hey, how's it going, everyone? It's Logan here. We're back in again with another video. And oh my god, did you know that news that happened? And you know, like, he, he Joe on Momo. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. We support. <laughs> no, for real. This is freaking awesome. So freaking awesome. Like, um, earlier. Well, not this yet. Ooh. Sorry, I thought a spider was calling out my neck. Earlier last year, or six months ago, there was another. There was a rumor that Hicho and Momo were going out, and they denied it. And now they are officially going out. And oh, dude, this is so awesome! This is so freaking awesome! I don't know. I think um, their chemistry, like whenever they're on the same show, was uh, so adorable and all that stuff. And it's just awesome to see that. Congrats to Hicho, my dude. I'm not jealous. But not really, you know, I, I have no chance of dating any K-pop idol, and if I somehow ever do, then what the hell has happened with my life? And I do not want to think about that, because that will never ever happen, so I just got to think about the things that will happen, like me making this video. <laughs> but what I thought we could do for this is just like go through everyone's uh, things for Heicho and Momo, and see some stuff that's happened, and yeah, uh, so let's just start with this one, eh? Just look at this! Someone edited the Wikipedia that says he's dating Momo, that lucky Bastard. Oh man, someone is ooh, jealous. I can't do that. I can't do it. But man, I'm loving this. He's been trending all day. I went to sleep with him trending for just a rumor about them. And then I woke up and then it was official. And I'm like, yeah, this has been like eight hours, my guy. And he's like, oh, wait, I'm pretty sure both of them are trending right now. Yeah. Oh no, Heicho is just trending now. And holy crap, that's freaking sick. Yo, 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 what's this? Heicho and Momo's interaction that started it all? The two had chemistry since the start. Now that Heicho and Momo are officially dating, fans have started reminiscing on one of their first public interactions together. Oh, so this is just like what the fans did. In Weekly Idol's fifth anniversary episode held over three years ago, the two had the iconic... Nico, Nico, ni. <laughs> it hurts me now, even when I'm editing this video. The Nico Nico Ni has made me cringe still once again. And the pain I go through is way too much. I can't handle it. I just can't. During a segment where the guests were challenged to raise Hito's heartbeat speed, heartbeat speed, heartbeat, Hito's heartbeat speed. Yo, I'm, wait, I'm saying it correctly. Wait. Yeah, I was saying it correctly. Momo imitated Nico Nico Ni, which is a popular catchphrase from the anime Love Live School Idol Project, which is a pretty good anime. My friend got me to watch it, but it's only if you like that type of anime. I wouldn't recommend it, but I would recommend it. Comment down below your favorite anime. I'm more of a like, you know, like uh, action-packed uh, type of guy for anime. Also, good stories. Oh man, good stories. If I could say my favorite anime, it would probably have to be Kuriko no Basket or uh, Haiku uh, or uh, Running with the Wind. Uh, those three are like, so freaking amazing, um, so awesome. And then my favorite fighting one would probably have to be Dragon Ball Super because, oh man, I love that show so much. I love anime. So comment down below your favorite anime and what you think about this relationship. Hicho and Momo. Wait, does that mean their ship name is... Heicho was visibly giddy from Momo's actions, especially when she held his hands. <laughs> the killing part for him, however, was when she cutely greeted him. Good morning in Japanese. Oh god. At the end of the interaction, Momo set the highest record, making Heicho's BPM reach 136. Yo, what the... Yo, that's insane! I gotta stop putting my hands on my desk because I don't have my camera on a tripod. God damn it. Okay, so that was their first interaction. And, oh man, that... That cute. That cute. <sighs> But yeah, if we go back to the star where it got confirmed, Label SJ and JYP Entertainment uh, said these two things. Kim Hee Chol and Momo were always close celebrity senior juniors, but recently they have began to meet each other with good feelings. Oh, I love this. After looking into it, we can confirm that the two celebrities uh, started as close senior juniors, but recently developed feelings for each other and are meeting each other. Oh, bro, I am loving this. And, you know, I hope that this will start to get more relationships to go out there because I mean like both of them are really freaking massive like he troll and super junior and all the variety shows he's in and just like everything about he troll is freaking awesome actually I read this thread last night 
and he's become my role model like no jokes he has become my role model of how much of a good human being he is like if you guys are interested in seeing this uh fred and all that stuff i'll leave a link in the description down below but like seriously i i spent like i think it was like 20 minutes just going through this entire thread of everything that he chose done that helps people and how he's such a good person and he's like my role model now like he seriously is my role model and I'm, I'm so freaking happy that uh he's now dating momo who is from twice and twice are like the most popular girl group in korea and japan and almost around the entire world like it, it's awesome how these two massive people they're coming together and i hope that this will get you know other idols to you know maybe maybe come out and start dating or just that it becomes more of a normal thing definitely because since he has been around for a long time uh in the industry uh that it would be a good thing he'll probably like release a post saying hopefully this will also help other idols you know come he'll probably say that like uh, he will actually probably say that because of this fruit that i read he will probably say that and if he does you all owe me five thousand dollars Okay, that's maybe a bit too much. Maybe like a like on the video and a subscribe. And if he doesn't, then still like the video and subscribe. Go! But yeah, if we go into their trends, let's just see what everyone is saying and just feel so happy. You know, we just need those good vibes going. Age doesn't matter, so congrats to you both. Ah. Kung Daniel and Heechul seeing each other at Twice as Dorms for the first time. Oh, I need to watch this. <laughs> <laughs> Some once is trying to argue that Heisha was too old for Momo when they are certainly the best. Yo, age doesn't matter when it comes to love. Come on, we all know that. Oh my god. Probably the people saying that are just people who don't understand love. Well, they clearly don't understand love because they don't support it. Oh god. Uh. <laughs> I'm so glad they're dating. Please, if anyone deserves to be happy, it's he told the mighty protector of female idols. He seriously is. Oh my god. I am definitely leaving a link to that thread down below. You guys go through it and just see how much of a great guy he is. Holy cremoli, guacamole. He is such a great guy. He, like, like, he covers like so many female idols, you know, like, you know, he like takes off his jacket for them and he gives them, like, he, He's just, he's just the right role model. I swear. JYP has been spilling the tea since then, but we didn't even notice. Congrats, Momo and Heecho. You're a wonder girl star here, J. I thought you like Momo. <gasps> <gasps> Yo, I am loving this. I, everyone is so supporting of it. Like when, like, um, uh, Je Jenny and uh, Kai were going out, people, so many people were hating against it. And now I'm starting to see that everyone is actually starting to accept that idols can date, which I thought um, would have been a first thing. Like, why would you not accept it? Like, do you really think that they're yours? Do you really think you own them? I don't know, right? But the idols are free to do what they want, and as long as they still make music for us and be happy on stage, then that's all that matters. Or happy off stage, that's all that matters, isn't it? Okay, that's all that matters. We support them no matter what, you know? We're, they're there to support us with their music and their variety shows, reality shows, and just like everything, their live stages, their concerts, they're there to support us, make us feel good. But we also need to be there to support them from behind the scenes. We need to help them with everything, you know? Like, we don't know what all of them are going through, but we should just always send out love. Why do people hate on other groups? I don't know. Why do people hate on other members in a certain group when they only like one member from a group? I don't know. But we should all support idols and just stop hating, okay? I'm just, it's, hate doesn't need to be needed. And I don't know why people hate. It just needs to stop. And I think if more idols come out dating, then, more support will be coming around because i love it when i see the fandoms just be like yo we need to support these two and it's so cute like when um kunk daniel and jiho went out like the the fandoms for both of them just came together and they support them and now we got um the elves and onces which i'm part of both so um 
it's, it's freaking cool just seeing how everyone is coming together um to support idols and we need to see this more often we need to see more support in this community i, I think we really do um just we don't need to hate i don't know why people hate is it because the charts they're scared i don't know but we should just support no matter what if you don't like a group's music then you're not a fan of their music you don't need to hate on them e anymore okay okay that's all that i need to say about that so let's go back to hito and momo the best couple wow that is actually real true hito has had one one hard year last year eh? he had a hard time lately he suffered health problems and couldn't be on stage with his bros lost two younger sisters and a dog and he went private on instagram right after for almost two months he just came back four days ago to admit he was having a hard time and now he too will be on hiatus but now he's got someone to be by his side uh momo and i'm pretty sure um that, that they've both helped each other out quite a lot um behind the scenes so damn i i feel i feel happy for hito now that you know it's out there he's officially dating maybe maybe you know his mental health will start to become better who knows i forgot how hito has kind of had a bad year i knew like he was like related to everything that's basically happened but i just completely forgot about that wow momo and hito confirms their relationship meanwhile all fans preparing to protect hito and momo heck yes <laughs> So you're saying Hito was 36 and Momo was 23? Heck yeah! 13 year age difference ain't anything! Wait, he's got a YouTube channel? I want to subscribe to his YouTube channel. Oh, he does live streams? Oh, heck yeah! Hey, subscribe. Imagine if we get a vlog of both of them! Oh, imagine if that's the first thing he uploads onto- I know he's taking hiatus from it, but imagine if like the first thing he comes back with is a vlog with Momo and they're like... Oh! <laughs> I mean, <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, I support it. I support it. All right. Thank you guys all for watching this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, uh, duh, duh. If you guys did, then show some support by leaving a like. Comment down below how much you support this relationship and the future ones in general. And if you want to share this video around with your friends, then go ahead, subscribe if you guys uh, want to see more videos like this where I just talk about the trends or uh, news in the K-pop community. And uh, yeah, hopefully you guys have had a great new year. And I'll see you guys tomorrow with a Red Velvet Psycho reaction. Peace.